So we're going to start this tune, Gypsy Eyes. It's tuned a half step down. So all you trying to play it in standard pitch are going to have a hard time playing it right here. You can always move it down one fret, but it's not going to be right. <laughs> so anyways, it starts off, uh, it's an A minor pentatonic shape. What you're going to do is you're going to go like a little pick slide with a little and then you're going to go right so we got seven five seven five on the d and then you're going to go up and you're going to grab the eighth fret on the low e so we got and then back down to the a note on the d string so we got right so it's the same sequence so we got now on that one, you're going to catch it on the upstroke, so it's down, up, down, up, down. And what you're going to do is you're going to hit the fifth fret of the G and the B. vibrato and then again so that's and that's just a bend up on the eighth fret of the B string so we got with a trill so it's so it's just a hammer on and pull off right so the sequence is the same with just an addition to little different riffs at, at the end of each sequence so we got mutes mutes with an upstroke Now that takes us up a whole octave higher to do the little uh, melodic riff he does right here. Right, so we got A minor pentatonic. We're going to start at the 17th fret and go to the 20th fret, so we got, and we're on the B string, now we're gonna bend it up twice, or three times, four times, <laughs> so we got, and then you're gonna go back down, and then you're gonna bend up, and you're gonna do a kind of a trademark Hendrix riff, where he bends up, and then you're gonna grab the G string, 19th fret so it goes and then you bring it down so you're bending up on 20 grabbing the G string and letting it down so we got so that's 19 so all together we got going to go up to the 19th fret on the D, back to the G, 17, so now we're going to go up to the 
19th fret of the D, 17th fret of the G, and then you're going to bend up a whole step on the 19th fret. So all together we got... So it's the same sequence over and over again. So we got. Again, really slowly, we got. gets us back down into the same spot we started the song in but the riffs a little bit different now so we got so we're going to start off and we're going to use our thumb we're going to do a slide and then you're going to hit with the thumb on the A of the low E. And then you're going to grab the B and the E strings of the 5th fret. So we got... Actually, hit the G string in there too. And then we go... So this time it's got a trill. And then you're going to down, up, and then you're going to catch the 8th fret of the E. So we got... to a G to A. So what we're going to do there is you're going to do the octave. So you're going to go G to A and then G to A. But the picking pattern is a little different so we got. Again. So he uses that bend up on the B and the G string, either on the 7th fret or the 5th fret, really frequently in this song. And the next part just goes... So again, we're going to use those G and B strings. That note right there is the uh, A on the D string, and then you're going back down, so we got. And it just lets that ring out. And then he does a little pentatonic riff here. So you're gonna slide up on the eighth fret, of the B string to the fifth fret. Now you're gonna go G string seven to five, and then you're gonna go seven on the D, seven on the G, five on the G. So all together we got slide to eight, five, seven, five, seven. So all together from that 
part after the little uh, solo riff down here, we got. sequence over one more time and then we got uh, one other little rhythm part that it does next time into the verse it goes <laughs> right so that riffs uh, pretty simple you got the bend up So that's just five to seven. So. Then the next time he goes through it, he adds a chromatic run. and you grab that A with your thumb. So we got. So we got. So uh, that's all we have time for in this lesson right here. But in the next lesson, we'll get into some of the other parts. You know, all throughout this song, even the rhythm part, there's tons of different guitars going on. So I'm just trying to pick a simple part that actually repeats itself. The other riffs in the song are, you know, all over the place. There are little pentatonic runs throughout the song. So at this point, just get the uh, basic rhythm structure down. You know, the... Um, Right? Again? To the riff? We got the riff. Right into the. Sequence over again into the That's just a bending up on the 15. And that's a 15, 13, back to 15, and then bend up again. 
pull off 14 on the G. Right? And that'll get us to the next part of the song. So, practice up. Because it's Hendrix's uh, groove here. I got tons more Hendrix coming. I know you guys all want a bunch of Hendrix. So, got some more on the way. All right. Catch you next time.